Oh, hi, Earth Signs. How you guys doing? Welcome in. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. I am going to be doing the spiritual business class next month. The master class, we're going to talk about uh, a lot of stuff, about back office stuff, about systems, also more about YouTube, more about putting it all together, how to monetize, what's a monetization strategy, kind of things like that. Um, so we'll be doing that, and I'm also going to offer, offer a second round of the beginner's class just to help you focus on what your idea is. That's what that's for. So bring your ideas because that's what's necessary so we can say, okay, let's walk down this road, okay? That's what we'll be talking about in the beginner's class. Bring ideas. It's not about like, oh, I don't know what I'm doing at all, so I, you got to have to give me ideas. It's not that, okay? you got to bring something to the table here with your plans, and then we'll work with it, okay? All right, so that's going on. Um, don't forget about the little um, contest I have. If uh, whichever Air, Fire, Earth, Water gets the most likes in August, I'm going to do a live reading. And for whoever wins, Earth Sign, if you guys win, I will do live. And for Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo, each one will get their own specific reading in that live. Okay, that'll be in September. So be sure to like the video. If you do like it, I hope you do like it. I hope it resonates with you today. hope you find it helpful. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Feel free to swap around the characters. I could be talking to a cross-watcher, so just keep that in mind. And by all means, just take what resonates and leave what doesn't for yourself, okay? All right, let's see where we go here. Let's see where we go. Oh, chaos and conflict. That showed up in the air sign reading. Unfinished symphony. Exchanging gifts. Yes. So something that didn't go so well. I'm going to use this. Some, uh, something from your past that did not go so well. I feel like this other person was had a lot going on. I almost feel like you can't really blame them. Even though you might have been blaming them. There's something that um, you don't really know about that was going on with this person. This person's from your past. All right, something that's been unfinished. And you're going to get a chance to clarify it or move forward with this person. Let's see where we go here. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. All right, my darling. Let's see. Page of Cups underneath. This deck is the good tarot. It always makes me laugh when I talk about that. I'm like, aren't they all good tarot? No. World. Six of Cups. Yep. You thought something was done and it's coming back around. Yes. On purpose. This is a important moment. Okay. This is somebody. Um, yes. This is a very important moment. Four of Wands. Ace of Swords, coming back to tell the truth. Nine of Swords, been really struggling with this. Four of Swords. Five of Pentacles and Eight of Swords. So this is a situation where this connection um, I feel like this person needs to tell you something. I don't know if it will help, but I do feel like it's going to be important for your own growth to listen or to be part of the conversation, okay? Um, I wanna just get clarity around this one thing down here, this five of pentacles, one please, just one. Clarity around that. Seven of swords. Somebody lied to you about money, or they lied to you about how much they had or didn't have, okay? About, they could have also lied to you about um, their own stability. They could have something really going on with them that they need help with here. Seven of Swords, Eight of Swords, Four of Swords, around Five of Pentacles. Somebody needs help here, okay? And I feel like... Um, 
this was a relationship that you might have had with somebody in the past and you it's like it's over okay it's over it went through chaos and conflict right this is the past world okay endings this person is coming back they might need your help or assistance okay you're the you're the world and the uh, six of cups and wheel of fortune this is going to be a reconnection with somebody they're going to tell you the truth about about this whatever they were lying about whatever they were hiding they're going to tell you the truth and then they're kind of afraid it's a healing thing for them to do so but they're kind of afraid of how you're going to take this okay they really are they're afraid how you're going to take it so there's there's an apology here all right that's a, a little bit of exchanging gifts this person is wanting to make make it right four of pentacles holding back nine of wands woo okay this person wants a new beginning yes this person's a cancer pisces scorpio queen of water and they lied to you about something I feel like they miss you a lot. I feel like they're worried about how you're going to take this truth, but it's the only way that they can figure out how to get back together with you. Even if you're like furious with them, I feel they think it's going to open up the wounds. It's going to heal the wounds. It's something they might have to um, make amends for. This could be somebody who had a drinking problem or had some kind of, a uh, financial problem, they did something, they might have stolen money from you, or they might have lied about how much money they had or didn't have, and um, they don't know how to move past it in their life. They don't know how to move past it. So the only way they can figure out to move past it is to come and tell you the truth. I don't know if that's going to serve you at all, do you know what I'm saying? Like, this is about them getting it off their chest, getting it off their conscience. I want to tell you what happened. It's very important to me that you know this. And you're like, okay, but this is over. Do we have to rehash this? It feels like a rehashing a little bit. But they are, they are determined to tell the truth. This could be, um, they are determined to tell the truth. High Priestess. Okay? Um, you know... You know who this is. If this reading is for you, you know who I'm talking about, okay? Um, this person kept a lot of secrets. I'm really getting a strong feeling that this might be something about their mental health or some kind of addiction that they had or some kind of um, lie that they told that they now are feeling like they have to set right or they won't be able to move forward in their life. Even if this relationship is done, okay? Even if this relationship is done. I feel like Pisces, Cancer Pisces Scorpio or Gemini. Cancer Pisces Scorpio, Gemini. Yeah, but that's Pisces, Wheel of Fortune. So um, they've really been holding on to this. Could have been for years but this person's going to come back and try to unburden themselves and get your forgiveness. They want your forgiveness here. I feel like they are stuck in their life without telling you. I don't know that you're going to be all that appreciative of this because you're like, I'm moving forward with my life. I'm done with this. I'm so done. Right? Whoopsie. I'm, I'm like, I, you know, this is ancient history. Okay, this is ancient history, and now it's coming back around. Um, but I want to say this to you. It might be ancient history. This person might have been, like, long in your past, or at least it's done for you. But I do feel like this has something to do with your ability to fully move forward. There's something here for you. This is not for nothing. All right, it's not just like, okay, yeah, go ahead. I'll tell you. Thank I'm sorry. Yes, I, you know, it's not for nothing that you're going to hear this. There's some benefit for you too, okay? There's some purpose, it's purposeful that you hear what they have to say for you too, okay? Okay, 
So I will look at uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, uh, and Gemini. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and Gemini. They're ready to sort of bear their souls, um, offer an apology, uh, but at the very least they lied about something and now they feel they could feel like their karma is really suffering right now because they lot whatever they did or whatever they said they did or they didn't do is in their way of their life progressing. So you're going to be the confessional. You're the one who's going to have to hear whatever they have to say to you. Um, so let's see where we go here. All right. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Gemini. I'll look at that in the extended I'm going to continue on with this reading. If it resonates for you, the link is below and I will see you over there.